Hello guys and welcome back to another cleaning motivational video. So today I have a get it all done video for you guys. And since we are in the middle of moving, it is part of prepping because there is things that needs to be done before we just basically pack the whole entire house and move. So we are going to be decluttering, organizing, doing lots of laundry, cooking, grocery haul, cleaning. We got a brand new microwave because the one that we have just suddenly went out on us there's so much motivation that is in this video and we are getting it all done because the next day we will be packing up the whole entire house so i hope you enjoyed this video if you are new here my name is naima Altador. i am a mother of three kids three boys very active boys and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please go ahead and subscribe to my channel i would love to have you and if you are already subscribed Thank you so much for coming back to another clean motivational video. Now let's get started. Staring at you when you make that smile. I'm moving closer to you now. I can't get close enough somehow. And I was down until you saved me, until you set me free. My eyes were closed. So like I mentioned guys, there's so much stuff that we have to do. Um, he is right now cleaning the boat that is part of the moving prep because he wants to go ahead and get this done. Let it air dry, let mother Man nature dry it and then put the cover over it because the boat is going to be remaining. So he wanted to get the cleaning out the way. And once he is done, he is going to be cooking. He makes the best lasagna. Oh my gosh, you guys gonna see that. There's so much motivation in this video, guys, doing a grocery haul because, quite frankly, I wanted to go ahead and just get a lot of stuff that I know that we need because we do have Walmart delivery, and I'm not sure exactly how fast Walmart is with a dress change. So at least for the first week, I wanted to go ahead and just already have things that I know that we need just in case you know just in case this video has a ton of motivation a ton of getting it all done so i really truly hope you enjoy this one because the next day guys we are packing it up which i already have the video for you guys so i can't wait for you guys to see that one it was a lot <laughs> packing an entire house it was a lot you can take me high when you In the first pack with me video, oh my gosh, we had to move that video. A lot of people had a lot of questions about the whole move. And in the whole house pack with me video, I will be answering all of that. I guess I'm turning it into like a little Q&A, just answering all those questions. Um, because a lot of people are wondering, did you buy another house? Are you renovating? Are you moving back? Like, what, what's going on? Like, why are you leaving? Why all the sudden? Why is the sudden move? What? Why do you need to leave in a week? Like, it was just a bunch of questions. So I'm going to be answering all of that in that particular video. So if you wrote any questions and I didn't get to it yet. I will definitely be getting to it in that video so hopefully you are listening and watching and so that way you can have your question answered those questions from that video is already answered in the whole house pack with me video however i can always go back and add to it and re-edit and stuff like that so since i'm already answering a bunch of questions if you have any other questions or just questions in general for me Go ahead and leave them down in the comment um, section so that way I can just go ahead and add those in that video as well. And you can also leave me questions on my Instagram at Door. So yeah, now we turn it into a little Q&A while you guys watch me pack <laughs> or watch us pack. <laughs> So 
so he wanted to make some work with play and decided to want to wet us I was not trying to get my hair wet but the kids were loving it so you're gonna hear the kids screaming and just love the fact that daddy is wetting them with the hose you're gonna get wet no stop no no so he is done cleaning the bowl, letting Mother Nature dry it. He's about to wash his hands because he has dinner to do. He is making lasagna, one of my favorites. I love it. So that is what we're about to do now, or he's about to do now. you every time I remember that it's over yeah you never break you never lie you never ever scared of the dark so why am I the one who cries when I tell you guys I love and appreciate this man for his cooking I'm not gonna lie <laughs> I'm gonna be very honest it is so helpful and the reason why it's helpful because all the cooking does not fall on me like we both cook and I love it when we actually in the kitchen cooking together the other thing is I love the fact that he takes his time to learn how to cook no one taught him he learned it all on his own and I love the fact that he, he did that because it is helpful for me <laughs> Because like I mentioned, it does not all fall on me. Like all the cooking, mommy, 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 mommy. No, all the cooking is mommy and daddy. And there are a lot of dishes that he makes. Honestly, I can't make it like him. And it takes extra special cooking from him. So I appreciate that a lot. So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind. Think about you a lot. It's almost like I can't stop, can't stop, yeah, yeah. You never lose an argument, so I've been trying hard to pretend that I'm okay. It's just a phase, and everything is going just great. I think about you a lot. It's almost like I can't stop, can't stop, yeah, yeah. So he is done prepping the lasagna. It is time for it to bake and we are doing some laundry and no, I am not sorting anything. Normally I like to sort, but right now I'm just trying to get it done. And because I'm not sorting anything, I will be washing the laundry in cold water so that way no, none of the colors bleeds out. 
The goal is to get it washed, get it done, so I don't have to take all that laundry with me to the new place because it's just the unpacking I would have to deal with and having to do a bunch of laundry on top of the unpacking. So yes, get it washed and get it done now. Don't succeed. Yeah, it feels like you're the one who said Everything is so hectic right now and the microwave that we have it just had to just stop working. It stopped working so we had to just get a portable microwave because we're doing a whole renovation. It's no point to do a built-in microwave when we don't even know what we're getting yet. So we got a portable microwave and it is okay because we actually need a microwave at the new place that we are going. So it actually, although the microwave just stopped working but it also worked out as well because we need one in the new location. Walmart delivery just got here so it's a lot guys so I didn't have a spot to lay everything out so I picked the four so we got toilet paper um Capri Sun 30% less sugar I couldn't find the one I really really wanted and then bleach pasta sauce uh, bananas cheese fresh spinach Avocados, we love avocados, mangoes. Look at this, guys. I am obsessed with this, okay? So I got the flavor that um, I like, which is mango, strawberry, banana, and mixed berries. And over here, we got the golden crispy crowns, bell peppers, chicken, tend um, uh, chicken breast tenderloins, um, coconut water. I love coconut water. So I got, this is the one I normally get, well, used to in the past. And then I, for some reason, I couldn't find them anymore and then started getting this one. So, so I like both. Um, Yeah, bell peppers I mentioned. Go, and I'm going to get fruit. Okay, one second. Go get for the kids, mashed potato, and a ton of these uh, green juice things. And then the cold press lemon water. They're ready to grab what they want. Eggs, bread, lettuce. This is what he wants. But he wants a triple chocolate muffins, strawberries, oranges. And then I got these two for the youngest. He likes them. Um, and then plantain over there. More bananas because my kids are obsessed. And then we got grapes red and green grapes i like the seeded grapes so i always make sure if they have it i get it so yeah and then we have the hershey's um syrup now this is an item that i do not get right so i like chocolate milk and for some reason walmart is always out of chocolate milk and i'm like okay what can i do to get the chocolate milk that I want. So I'm like, how about, let me just get the syrup, <laughs> mix it with uh, milk, and then that'll be like my chocolate milk, so that's the reason why I got that. But yeah, did I forget anything? I think not. So yeah, guys, this is all the items that I got. So I have a major restock to do, so I ended up getting a lot of stuff my walmart grocery haul did you guys see the lasagna oh my gosh so yummy and juicy but anyways the grocery haul was a lot there were so many stuff that needed to be purchased it's like i felt like the fridge was just empty and i was like let me go ahead and stock up so that way when we move we would pretty much like the first week we would have like a lot of food to start with because we do have walmart delivery and then we have to transfer the address over and i don't know how honestly i don't know how quick that takes i don't know how fast they are with that and i'm like let me just go ahead at least you know the first week will be good and then we can start our walmart delivery in the new place so it is a few hours later we had dinner and oh the lasagna guys he makes the best lasagna i'm always requesting the lasagna 
I don't really make lasagna like that. I mean, I know how to make it, but the fact that I love when he makes it, so I always requested lasagna. And so anyways, we had dinner a few hours later and now we are organizing. I'm organizing all the kids' toys and I am going to be decluttering and organizing all that stuff you see on top of the, I don't know what it's called, where we put all the kids' bit, um, toy bins in. On top of that, <laughs> I'm going to be decluttering and organizing that because tomorrow, like today, I felt like was a little smoother, a little easier. We took a breather, we took a breather, but tomorrow, guys, is game time. Tomorrow is no joke. It's like, because we already have so many boxes already, and it is game time. This entire house needs to be packed. And what I'm doing, the reason why I am organizing the kids' toys because I'm not taking everything. I'm not taking all their toys with them. I'm only taking the ones that I know for sure, sure, sure they love and going to play with. And the rest are just going to be boxed up. I already boxed a ton of toys in their bedroom, which you probably already seen that video. If you have it, I am going to put it in the description box so you guys can go ahead and check that out. So while I'm organizing them, I'm also picking which toys are going and which toys are not going. So that way I know which bins to grab. I may take um, that bin organizer thing with me because we do have space in the new location for that. So I may take that with me. I'm debating. It makes sense too, so that way I can have somewhere to put them. But I'm also debating as well. Because quite frankly, I don't wanna take every piece of furniture with me. So that is why I'm debating. Something, something, something from you that feels right But I know nothing, 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 nothing Nothing will do, nothing's fine You tell me that you care for me But I don't think it's true You say I know you got But baby, all you got is you You promised me your everything But never see it through I don't think you're true so if you didn't cash out the reason why the groceries were on the floor that is because there was no space the counters were full again we're in the middle of um moving so the stuff are everywhere the counter is full table is full and we had the walmart delivery and quite frankly guys i wasn't planning on doing a grocery haul the stuff came the plan was to just put everything away but then again i was like wait a minute it's a lot of stuff i can actually like um just lay it out and uh, do a grocery haul show you guys what i got so that is the reason just in case you're like why did you put that on the floor so that is the reason just lay it out i mean it's fine <laughs> picked everything up and put away um yeah so i did enjoy doing the grocery haul for you guys i really did and i hope you had enjoyed watching that So I am soon to be a mother of four and I only have one kid in school, which is my five year old. And when he started preschool, guys, I kept everything. I mean everything. 
and now that he is in kindergarten i know i find myself keeping everything as well so it's like i don't know it's just memories i want to do like um what do you call it like um a memory book or a craft book um so there's things that i'm going to be keeping for that and there's things i'm not going to be keeping for that just for just memories so when he gets older <laughs> he probably won't care when he gets older like okay mom i seen this and yeah whatever let me go live my life but for me when i get older when i'm old and gray i'll have something to look at all his you know when he used to draw and i don't know like there's stuff that I want to keep for me, for memories, and just see the, his stages in life, preschool, it's, you know, his first year, his second year, and stuff like that, and see his progress. And I want to do that with all the kids. So yes, I do plan on keeping certain things um, of his, of all of theirs, and in certain things I'm, I'm as you see, watching right now i am decluttering so let me know in the comments below if you keep a lot of your kids stuff and i do also plan on keeping some baby clothes so that way when they have their own children i can pass it down to <laughs> i don't know i'm just being really emotional right now but like i mentioned i just want to keep a few things of theirs as reminders memories and stuff that i can look back when i'm old and gray and just I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> you get the point. it was so much that i had to go through and stuff just kept piling up and it was one of those i'll get to it moment and then it piled up some more and then i would look at it and honestly not really feel motivated to get it decluttered and then i would think to myself well i'll just get to it and there were so many other things that were going on and when i realized we had to actually like move move and i was like oh gosh well i can't declutter the entire house because one the timing i don't have time to declutter the entire house because the time that we have we should be packing but the fact that this kept piling up and piling up and there's like so much papers that i know that have to be thrown away so much decluttering in this section that has to be done let me just get this part done at least because if i didn't do it i would pretty much take everything with me and do it at the new place and i was like i don't know if i want to do that so i went ahead and just just get it done pretty much get it done you just believe it i know we can make it we used to be strong love don't forget where you Give me a 
So we are almost done with decluttering and organizing. I had to get rid of so much stuff and a lot of papers. And I feel so much better now. We're supposed to be packing, but for me, it's like, okay, I don't wanna take the stuff that I don't need. And it would be nice if I had like maybe a week to declutter the entire house, but things are just moving so fast. I'm like, at least let me do this little portion, at least. Once I am done, I am going to be showing you the missing clips of the house projects. Um, for some reason, I couldn't find them to put them in that particular video, but I have them now and I want to share with you guys in case if you wanted to see it. But um, pretty much that would be the end of the video. And if you are new, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you and thank you guys so much for watching. And if you already subscribed, thank you, thank you thank you and guys the next video is going to be a whole house pack with me so stay tuned for that that door is going to be here mm -hmm. which is this door right here it's a little dark in here Uh, still a construction zone. There's people here. <laughs> they brought this down. You see? Look at all of this mess. They brought this down. I guess they're enjoying themselves. <laughs> they're the right size. Alright, let's see an update of what's going on. doing something it looks exactly the same honestly it looks exactly the same uh, let's see oh, nothing's wet it looks exactly the same all right I know my eyes are not paying tricks on me I saw him doing something and it looks exactly the same all right well I don't know nothing about construction He's he's a professional, so he knows what he's doing. All right. Oh, let's leave the light on for him. 
and this is almost done the first coat is on they have to put another coat the door is still not on all right let's see the bathroom guys just a quick update i'm starving and then i'm gonna go ahead and get something to oh nope the color is gonna change i don't like this color um it just looks too white all of the color um the name of it is not like white or pure white it looks extremely white and this was the color before so yeah i don't like the color so we got new paint he has to redo this all over again he's not gonna be happy but yeah we changed the color with new paint now see you guys it's a mess all of this is still there um uh, yeah still can't do laundry it's blocked so the clothes the clothes are starting to pile up and i would definitely have a <laughs> laundry motivation for you guys because the clothes are piling up yeah this is what i was showing again but um yeah it's probably one of them put them down put that down to enjoy themselves while they work <laughs> but it's okay we're okay with it it's okay they can enjoy themselves because no one here does yeah so yeah so once everything is clean um well once everything is done i'm gonna go ahead and clean up this place but yeah it's coming along guys i'm so excited yay the house is a mess but it has to i guess look like this before it gets all done and people have been coming in and out in and out in and out and yeah it's, it's no way for it to remain polished but it's okay because what when you when you're doing some form of renovation it's gonna always be some kind of mess anyway <laughs>